Okay. How do you write 0 0.04 into a fraction? And that's... Cool. Okay. That's the hundreds. What's the hundreds? The zero or the four? The four. Mm -hmm. Oh, whoops. Okay. <laughs> that's the hundreds. And then that's tenths. Okay. And this is the ones. Okay, so how would you read this number? Zero point zero four hundredths. Mm -hmm. Close. It's just four hundredths. Four hundredths. Okay, so how do so you write it as a fraction? Good. But that could be simplified. Could that be simplified? Uh, yes. Can that be simplified? No. No. Okay, circle that answer. This one? Or? Well, what's the answer? Ah. It's always simplified oh, as the answer. Okay. <laughs> okay. That kind of so, makes it kind of stand out. Let's say we have zero. Zero point zero two five. How do you read that number? Twenty five thousandths. Okay, so how do you write that into a fraction? Good. Is that number five? Yes. Well, this one ends in a five. This one ends in a zero. So no. No. Okay. So. What does it become? Ten. Yeah, it can. It can? Because if it ends in a 5 and a 0, it's divisible by what? 5. 5. So 25 divided by 5 is? 5. 5. And then? 10. 5. 10 divided by 5 is? 5. No? No, 2. 2. And then 0, 0. Okay? 5 over 200. Can it be simplified? Yeah? So you get 1 over mm, 20 divided by 5 is 4. And then 0. Mm -hmm. Good. Mm -hmm. So earlier you said 0 0.04 is the same as 1 over 25. And 0 0.025 is the same as 1 over 4. I think. 1 over 40. Mm -hmm. Right? Okay, so you know how to go from here to here. Right? From here to here. How do you go from here to here? Um. Um. <coughs> so what does that say? 125. 1 over 25. What does over also mean? Divide. Divide. 1 over 25 also means 1 divided by 25, right? Mm -hmm. So how would I write that? 1 divided by 25. That would be 25 divided by 1. Oh. So that's always a confusing thing. Okay, so 25 divided by 1. So how are we going to get 0 0.04? I'm going to move it a little lower so that we get some space. So we get 25 and 1. 
How are we going to get 0 0.04? Um, can we divide this? Yeah. So if 25 doesn't go into 1, what can we do? Add a 0. Add a 0. But 25 doesn't go into 10. But when we add a 0, what else do we have to add? Because now it's saying 10 over 25. Is 10 over 25 the same as 1 over 25? No. No. So what can we do about it? Zero here. We could, but then that's just going to reverse the process. Or that turns into a 3. You can't just change the number. So if... Okay, so if I want to um, divide it and I add a zero, I have to add a decimal. Uh, okay, so I to, if I put a decimal there, because technically mm -hmm. it's right there, I have to add a decimal on top. Okay. Uh, so does 25 go into 10? No. no. So what do we do? Add a zero. Where? After the 10. After the 10. Okay. Well, what, what about here? We put a zero, zero. here, right? So then, does 25 go into 10? Does 25 go into 100? How many times? Four. Four times. And then four times 25 is? 100. 100. And then we subtract, and we get a zero, which is a happy face. Yay. So then we get 0 0.04. Okay? You're going to do the next one. Made with DoodleCast Pro.